Welcome to day one of building my file organization app. Day one mostly consisted of research. Initially, I decided on Electron as my framework, React.js as my front end, and Python as my back end. Since React.js is the UI library I'm most familiar with, and Python is known for its machine learning. And so I was pretty set on the setup. But after three hours of debating, debugging, and setting up the project, I scrapped it. I had a good reason, though. I honestly just didn't like the idea of building this app on Electron. If you're not familiar, Electron is the go-to for building cross-platform applications. For example, Discord, Slack, VS Code, and many other desktop applications use it. And don't get me wrong, you can build amazing applications with it. VS Code is a prime example of what a good Electron app looks like if done right. But I'm a single developer and I don't have this huge team for optimizing code whilst developing the app. And I'd rather not overconsume space if I can avoid it. I mean, the large language model itself already hoards a lot of space. But so here's what I pivoted towards. Tori as my framework. React.js as my front end, and Rust as my back end. Rust isn't known for machine learning, but there's a lot of work changing that, and I think it has a lot of potential. Tori is also a relatively new technology, more so than Rust, but I don't think Tori, much less Rust, are going to be disappearing anytime soon and already have all the features I need to get this application up and running. Well... Wow. Maybe. There's some libraries I'm looking into and I think will work. Worst comes to worst, I could just ditch one or the other and resort to Python or, well, I don't think I'll need Electron, but anyhow, that's a little background update on day one of developing this app. If you'd like to keep up with my day-to-day -day development, follow along for more. Bye.